What's the sticker price on that? John Bolton says Giuliani was like a hand grenade. I said Giuliani, the only way to fix him was for Donald Trump to take him out and put some concrete boots on him. Now it turns out that it looks like Giuliani truly was helping Donald Trump to commit crimes back in the 1990s and was helping Donald Trump out to get ahead in New York. How many other criminal activities has Giuliani and Donald Trump been in for the lifetime of Donald Trump? And how does this relate back to Cohen? Because we know that Giuliani he was leaking information through his sources out of the FBI to Donald Trump. Did Giuliani know that Bolton had not... Did he know that Bolton was watching? That's the question. Because we know that Bolton was put into the position as the person for Donald Trump because of Donald Trump's money that he took in, the people that had supported him during the campaign. And we knew that Bolton... And his job policy was completely different than that of Pompeo. And we knew that Pompeo, Michael Pence, Michael Flynn all had a company and that they were working in the desert a year before Donald Trump even got elected. However, what we also see from Giuliani is, is that the same bad guys that were donating to Donald Trump's campaign, that $350,000, and working over there to get Volodymyr Zelensky hired and working with Manafort, were in pictures with Donald Trump in 2014 when he separated himself from his own banking accounts and then gave over his abilities for himself to his lawyer. And that pretty much signifies that this whole thing was pretty well planned out and that Donald Trump's been working in this position, which explains why Mike Pence is going over there to talk to Erdogan, because he's personal friends with Erdogan, because he's part ownership of the company that Mike Flynn's a part of, and he thinks that he's got some type of pull with Erdogan. Maybe he thinks that he can get that, I don't know, um, the profit out of the United States or something if he'll stop. That would be interesting, wouldn't it? Now that you know that everything that's going on is part of a franchise, how do you feel about that? I mean, honestly, do you believe in things that are bad or do you believe in things that are good or do you just believe in the balance of which is in between that we're seeing right now you can say a lot of things in life you can say 10 hail marys you can say you know go packers you can say all sorts of stuff but one thing that you cannot say is that this is going to come out in a good way for mr trump there's just no possible way. If they start exposing the company for what it is, the franchise, and they show that they did it on purpose in order to beat Hillary Clinton, and then they took her information on how to cheat in the campaign from her and used it against her, and how they actually cheated in 2016 to get the election process done, Democrats and Republicans are just going to pop. Their heads are going to blow up like little purple sacks, and there's going to be powder everywhere. It's going to be crazy. Anyways, go John Bolton. Go figure that John Bolton would get away from a sinking ship and call other people rats.